So today we have a patient who has a trigger finger on the right <clears throat> fourth. You can tell he stays in this. You can actually pop, feel the tendon sheath pop back. It's a chronic issue, so we're going to do a <clears throat> trigger point injection. So what you're going to use, you're going to use um, Depomedrol. You can use 40 milligrams of this, which equals 1 ml. And you're going to use 2 cc's of lidocaine. 5 cc syringe with a 25 gauge needle. So then we're going to go ahead and prep the area. A little bit of alcohol. Circular motion. A circular motion. So I always like to mark my injection site with the tip of the needle. So you come, you can feel the actual injection site, which is right there. You can actually feel the little nodule right there that the tendon is getting stuck on. Okay, mark that. You okay, sir? Yeah. Okay. Feels a lot of pressure. Okay. Yeah. So now you have a beautiful circle. And you can tell exactly what you need to. So we're gonna go ahead and inject parallel to the tendon at a 45 degree angle. If you hit the bone, you've gone too deep. If you hit the bone, you literally just come back about a millimeter right into the tendon. And you know you've done it right when you feel the tendon expand under your needle. You feel a little bit of pressure, okay, sir? Right through there, a little poke. You okay? Yeah. As soon as I get in normal, I like to give a little bit of lidocaine just to give it a little bit of numbing. You can actually feel it expand under you. You okay? Come straight down. You good? You okay? I'm good. Make sure you feel the bone right there. Come back up a little bit. Aspirate, make sure you're not in the bloodstream or any kind of vessels, and just give your patient the medicine. Good? Yeah. You see how fat that's getting? Okay. You pull the needle out. Okay. I like to always massage my medicine and have my patient open and close. Yep. You guys should feel it popping under there. Good, perfect. 